All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. As always, I'm Kyle. We are looking at a custom canvas. Actually, it's a box. It's still in the box. Um, printed by Dreamer Design. Now, real quick, I have no idea what the canvas is like. Um, haven't done one of their one of their canvases before. My biggest issue is it took about twice as long as the website said. Website said seven to 14 business days. Um, so that's my biggest issue so far. Um, let's open this up and see what the canvas is like and the gems and the accessories. I will say, I think a lot of <clears throat> Dreamer Designs non-custom prints are printed here in the United, here in the States. Um, their custom ones are not. Those are printed over in. Well, the package I think came from Hong Kong. So, um, pretty big box. Um, I think I went with a 30 centimeter by 30 centimeter size. Um, that was the smallest I went with that still gave, that would still give really decent, um, real decent picture quality. Um, any smaller and you start losing detail, any bigger and it would just be too big. Um, all right. I mean, box is a little damaged, but I mean, one, it's a diamond painting, so not much to get, uh, damaged in it. And two, it's coming from... Hong Kong, so I mean, it's kind of understandable. So, <clears throat> all right. That doesn't, <laughs> the box seems bigger than what came out of it. Interesting. All right. So, got a nice little printed bag. I really hope this is decent. Um, one, because I waited so long. And two, I'd like... Like, I was really disappointed with Heartful Diamond's um, quality. Two of them we've done. Um, one, the gems just didn't stick very well. That's the Iron Man one. And then the Princess... Disney Princess one. Um... Just the, the detail, very, very poor detail for how big it is. Um, so right off the bat, it is kind of a cotton felt like material. Um, all right, hold on, let's... <laughs> it's like, wait a minute, where are the gems? The diamonds, what are you going to call them? Nice printed little bag for the accessories. All right. Nice tray. It's got the oh, folds out so you can dump the so you can dump the gems out. Got your little accessory there. Your squishy thing gripper for the pin. Of course, we're not going to be using their pin. Got some purple wax here. It looks a little different than the normal wax. I don't know if maybe that's just because of the color, but uh, probably end up using that. Got the pin. Of course, all the, the kits come with these cheap pins. 
Um, oh. Look, so it comes with two pins. One with a tip I've not used before. Comes with metal tweezers. That's nice. They meet very well at the end, too. That's nice. So far, I am pretty happy with uh, with how this kit is turning out. Um, ah, okay. That's nice. I like that. <clears throat> All right, so we got another thing of wax. We have what looks like Probably, probably a three-placer, and then probably a six or eight. Is that it? Oh, nope. We got another. Oh, we got a straightener and another pin gripper. Um, so far, like I said, I'm happy with. I mean, these are the pins or whatever. Um. But so far, I am happy with what we're looking at. So next, we will unroll the canvas. All right. Mom, if you're watching this video, um, I would ask you don't watch this one. Because this is one for you. So you can watch it later. Maybe. Anyways, let's get into it. All right, let's uh, let's unroll the canvas here. Actually, first, here are the colors. Oh, good lord! Oh, and they are individually bagged. Um, is I figured this out with the crystal canvas ones. Um, it's nice that they're individually bagged. But it's also kind of a pain because it's kind of difficult to get to dump them back in the bag. So, I mean, if you don't have, if you don't have containers to dump the drills in, it's nice. Um, but I will end up transferring these to containers. So, no, I'm not doing anything else with it. All right. Oh boy. All right. Wait, what? What is this time in painting? This is for grandma. Okay. It is a cute puppy. Mm hmm. So okay. it just gives your. Stop, stop, Zoe. Let go. Go, please. Okay. So it gives you, it's got a pamphlet in there, kind of a uh, beginner's guide. Um, but in all honesty, this is not going to be a, this would not be one for beginners. My goodness. Um, it does look really good though. Um, okay. My, uh, I misspoke. This is 60 by 60. Which I thought I got a different size. I'll have to go back and check my order. Um, but anyway, so with the exception of how long it took to get it, I am I am pretty happy with uh, with how it came out. So I got a couple others to finish before we get started on this one. Um, but. Stay tuned, and uh, we'll see you when we get started on this one and all my other ones. So, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy this little quick unboxing of the Dreamer Design Custom Canvas. And uh, here shortly, we will get started on it. So, thank you once again. Hope you guys enjoy this. Like I said, I know I repeat myself. Um, but, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy it. Love you guys. And we'll see you in the next one.
All right, so in conclusion, as of right now, I would recommend Dreamer Designs custom canvases. <laughs> like I said, um, just beware. I don't know if it's because of the size, but just beware it could take up to a month to actually receive it. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you all in the next one.